only on Local 10 tonight, we're hearing from the Good Samaritan who jumped in to save a toddler after she fell out of a car and that baby's mother then yanking her out of her arms. Local 10's Christian De La Rosa has the exclusive now from Hialeah. This woman tells us she found the baby bloody and covered in gravel. She's speaking to us. She doesn't want to share her name, but can you imagine if she hadn't been there at the right place at the right time? Hey, are you okay? It's okay. I'm going to sit down. Come here. Everything just happened so quickly. I guess God was on our side that night. Speaking to Local 10 News, the Good Samaritan, who may have saved a baby girl's life in Hialeah. She was bleeding. She was severely hurt. She was very out of it. Hello, I need you to come. I need you to come. The woman calling 911 after picking up the small child off the ground near Northwest 54th Street and 37th Avenue in Hialeah Thursday. Police say the one-year-old came out of a moving car. The mother later shows up. There is my baby. Okay, but she, oh my God, I need you guys to come. The first thing I thought that was gonna come out of her mouth was, oh my God, my baby. Or one kind of child abuse. The baby's mother, 29-year-old Tasha Mills, in court Wednesday. And one kind of child neglect. Authorities accusing Mills of doing something unthinkable. So she pushed the victim out of the car because she spilled shampoo in the car. Child neglect, child abuse. Hurting kids when they're, they don't know any better, it's sad. Like, kids don't deserve that. They don't know any better. So the baby is under the care of the state as far as the mother. If and when she's able to bond out of jail, the judge has ordered no contact with her child. Reporting in Hialeah, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News.